My name is Sharon Needham. I was diagnosed at 42 years old with lung neuroendocrine cancer. So neuroendocrine cancer has been misdiagnosed, typically for most patients, five to seven years. For probably close to 10 years, I was seeing various doctors for rashes on my body, stomach issues, diarrhea. I was given asthma medication. I had heart palpitations. I was also told by doctors that I was just stressed out and working too much, uh, but really it was my lung tumor. I ended up having a pneumonia and I went to the hospital because I couldn't breathe and that started a series of tests over six months where I finally had my tumor found. I had a major lung surgery through my back to remove my lung. I was fortunate that my surgeon was able to do a procedure called a sleeve resection and save my upper left lobe of my lung. Within 12 hours from surgery, they had me up and walking in my hospital room and then I was walking the halls before they released me to go home. Then I went home and it was walking to the end of the driveway or walking a few houses down the street until I got to a point where I decided I'd do a half marathon. And so I've done five in the last six years. I've committed to challenging myself every year since being diagnosed. And this year I decided I would do the ride for cancer. I'm excited to see other survivors. I'm excited to ride with friends and do something to give back to other patients. Last week was my six year cancer anniversary and that day I had the scan in Halifax at the QE2. After my scan, I received a call from my oncologist. Whew. Sorry. <laughs> I am cancer free. Big celebration, big relief. When I cross the finish line, it's gonna be probably a real uh, icing on the cake for a, a long year. But I'll also be celebrating that I'm turning 49 that weekend and I'm cancer free and crushing it.